Hey everyone, we're starting off with a three cheese itty marinara for lunch with a few of these sun garden salsa sun chips with a Pepsi. So yeah, I just wanted to show you what I'm going to have on here, but now I'm going to go on live and eat. So I'll see you there if you're there. Hey everyone, it's me. I'm back. Sorry, here I'll fix the phone back in action. I'm just going to make the meat for the tacos. So I'm just going to jump right in and get started. So here's my pan. And I just got the 80-20 from Aldi's and it's US. DA approved and this is 2.30 pounds so it's 279 a pound so it made it a total of 642 when I purchased it so it's about two and about two and a half pounds I'm just gonna get this started here some people put oil in with theirs but I surely don't so I'm just going to find a little spatula here. Actually, I can use this. This is great. So I'm just going to chop this up. And as, it, as it's cooking, I'm going to start chopping the lettuce up. It's 1.46 p.m. here. Nice old sunny day out. It's not too cold. It's not too hot. So I had a very, I know you guys can't see me, but here I am. So I really had an issue this morning. So my mom needed something picked up from Goodwill that she bought. It was, it's like an end, a coffee table for in the middle of the living room. And I went to go pick it up for her with my truck and I took Dulce with me. And I put Dulce on the leash, got her in the truck and we, we went. And all of a sudden I get back, we, I... Well, I help my mom take it out. I put it in her house for her. I help her. And I get back here and I put Dulce on the... Because I don't have her on the leash when she's in the car. I take the leash off of her. And then I put it back on when she gets, we get out. So I put it back on her when we got home and we got out of the truck. And then I put her down. And all of a sudden she starts running forward and the leash snaps. And she's off the leash. Completely off the leash. Walking around sniffing stuff. And I said, it's okay, Dulce. It's okay. Like, I put my hand out. Come here. And all of a sudden she starts sniffing the sewer and stuff. And then she walks, like, toward in the middle of the street. And no cars were coming. I was totally watching everything. And I thought she wasn't going to come toward me. And I went, here, Dulce. Come here. And she did. And I'm, thank God I was able to grab her. I have her inside now. And she's, I'm really not letting her out till I go get a leash at, like, 4 p.m. So... I'll have to take her out and I'll, I don't know, I'm going to have to put puppy pads down or something for now until I get it in like two hours. So I'm going to have to do that. So any judgment, I don't mind if you judge on that because I have to do that. So that's what happened and that was a little issue that I had today. So I just have a head of dull lettuce. Iceberg lettuce that I'm going to cut up here. The meat is browning. Oh, yeah. Brown, brown, brown. Meat, brown, brown. Get my cutting board. Hello, Mama. Hold on, you guys. I have to check on what she's getting into over here. What are you doing, Mama? Playing with the end of the couch. Alright. 
have that going. Grab my knife here. And I'm just going to cut the um, core out of it here. Cut the core out. Give this a quick stir. Yeah, you smell meat, Mama. I call her mama so much. Let's drop the piece out of here. Oh, that's browning pretty quick here. Not near done though. See, I just take the first piece of this off. And I'll cut it in half because I don't need the whole head of lettuce. I think I will cut this one up. And I'm going to save that. Okay. Oh, that has brown on it. Won't kill us. It won't kill us. Sorry everyone, I got a call from my my doctor's office there real quick, so I had to answer that. I'm just cutting this into long long strips and then I'm gonna go the wide way too. So bring it all up and then just start. I mean it doesn't have to be too tiny, but I don't want it too huge either, so is like showing all capabilities of being brown here. So, capabilities. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just talking. I'm being goofy. You can see it's brown, but it is not done yet. I like my meat well done and small. I mean, not too small to where you can't bite it. Because you get those, if you get big chunks, usually they're not done in the middle. And people think they are all the time. But I don't like my meat like that. I try to not have too big of chunks. But not too little to where it's all diced and or minced. And you can't put any in your taco either, though. I'll let that sit a few more minutes. I'm going to check on Dulce again. Dulce, what are you doing, Mama? What are you doing? You want some meat? Mama, rinse it off for you. I'm going to give Dulce a little bit of this meat. I have to rinse it off so it can't have grease on it. I'm going to let 
that sits still. Just dice up my lettuce a little bit more. can put that in a gallon Ziploc. I'm going to keep that because it will help me um, on the rest of the gallon. That's just like two gallons. Excuse me, Dulce. Please stop. Yeah, right. Like a dog's going you know, to listen to that. Okay, Mom, I'll stop. No. I am just rambling today, you guys. I'm rambling. that up in a minute. Alright, I'm going to put a bowl and I'm going to just put a tiny bit in there for you, okay? Well, maybe not that much. That's quite a bit. Now, rinse that off. I'm going to drain my grease, too, in a minute here. Mama? Alright. Okay, there's my ground beef. All cooked thoroughly. Now I'm just going to start adding the seasoning. You all done? Let's not drag this though, honey. Okay. Alright, we're done with that. Okay. Okay. So, all right, I'm going to do one of the, two of the miles, Taco Bell miles. I know some people make their own, but I like to use this, so that's what we use here, folks. And fill that pouch up with water. And then have another mile. Here's another one. Pour that in. Fill that up with water. 
pour that in. I'm just going to give this a stir real quick. I know I'm letting my water run. Okay. And then I'm going to add one original. One original. So that looks like this. Okay. Open that up and put that in. Fill that up with water. Pour it in. And voila. We have taco meat. Not too dry. Not too watery. that is done the tackle meat is done so i'll see you in the next thing that i do